Hi, I'm Dr. Joni Liu, and welcome to another Cosmic Tidbit. And today, I want to talk again about the collective ego and how it has put its control on you. You know, we have the gift of language. Language was a gift from the cosmos to us human beings. But remember, according to the basic cosmic principle of harmony, of equality, that doesn't make us any better than anything or anyone on this planet, okay? We are all equal. So whether something is inanimate, like a rock or concrete, or something is an animal or a plant, an insect, we are all equal to each other. I want to make this very, very clear. Okay, very, very clear. Because language is a gift, but it does, you know, it makes us unique in the cosmos. That's all it is. And that also follows the cosmic principle of harmony of uniqueness. Everything is unique. We are unique. We are individuals. So each one of us is unique from another individual. And that is what is important. But the collective ego uses language to set us apart. And one of the first words that it likes to use is special. It wants us to feel special, but it denies our uniqueness. It wants us to be special, and yet it tells us that we're not good enough at the same time. So that creates conflict. Because our true nature, our inner truth, knows that we aren't special. But the thing is, is that it has also used the word good against us. So the word good has been used to mean that if we don't conform to the collective ego, then we're not good. Okay? But good is what it should mean, which it, which is a good thing, okay? <laughs> but the collective ego wants us to think that if we do not conform, then we are bad. Okay, so I'll talk to you again about this very important issue in another Cosmic Tidbit. Talk to you soon. Bye.